In this video, we'll be demonstrating the MyWay 3-beam balance. We are Precision Way Imbalances and we're an authorized MyWay distributor. Um, the 3-beam balance is one of the most popular mechanical balances that we have to offer. And we like to review and highlight some of the features that MyWay offers. So, this triple beam balance, the reason why it's called a three beam balance, you'll notice there are three beams here. So we have the beam all the way to the back is from zero to 100 grams. The center beam goes from zero to 500 grams. And the very front beam is from zero to 10 grams. And we have graduations to a tenth of a gram. Now you'll notice on the three beam balance there are notches on the beam itself that the rider is um, dropped into. So you'll notice right here, let's see if I can zoom in a little bit on it and show it to you. There's a notch right here. So when you slide the rider down you want to make sure it's locked into position. And so, this is how you weigh on the three beam balance. So, just to give you an example, let's put on, I have a, I have a mass that I'm going to put on. It's a, uh, we'll put on this large item on the weighing platform. And I just want to review exactly how you use a three beam balance. So, the goal with a three beam balance is you always want to use the largest poise first and so you want to bring the poise all the way over to the 500 and see if the beam drops and when the beam drops you know it's too heavy so you would slide the poise back to the 400 and again the beam drops slide the poise back to the 300 and you'll notice now the beam is up so you really I guess I have to zoom out a little bit to show you the beam is up. So now we slide the 0 to 100 gram port rider all the way across and you'll see it goes down and you just basically want to start sliding it back until the beam goes up. So still down, still down, okay the beam is now up. So we want to go to the front beam and again you just want to slide until it goes beam starts to drop. Well the right way is to have the beam down and then we want to slide the poise back. And the beam you'll notice on the right hand side there is a hash mark there and that hash mark has lined up so we know that the beam is now balanced and what to determine the weight all one needs to do now is to add up the three beams so you'll notice the middle beam is at 300 the beam in the back is at 30 and in the front the front rider you'll notice looks like about 8.2 grams so you'd have 300 plus the 30 plus the 8.3 so you're looking at 338.3 grams this item weighs so it's pretty easy to use the three beam balance and um, let's just highlight a few of the other features that my way has to offer over competitor brands so the biggest thing is my way comes standard with your three attachment weights many other brands on the market and there's lots and lots of other brands you'll see on the market they don't include the attachment weights they'll charge you I don't know we see people charging up to uh, fifty dollars for these attachment weights so you get three attachment weights and what these are 
you have a 1000 gram attachment, another 1000 gram, and a 500. Now these weights, these attachment weights don't actually weigh 1000 grams and 500. The way they work is they get attached to the end of the beam. And so it's giving you the equivalent mass. So on this three beam balance, you will notice at the very end here, there are two knobs. And you attach your attachment weight, you'll notice there's a little groove here. So it goes this way. And you hang the attachment weights right on the beam. And so there's a thousand, here's 500. Now, you do a thousand and a thousand. So all you do is you could put two attachment weights on. And I'll show you how to use these attachment weights. So, <clears throat> again, before weighing, you want to make sure all your poises or riders are all the way back. You want to make sure they're in the groove. And if we have a large item that we want to weigh, to determine the mass of, we'll just say I have a large container here. If I put this container on, I slide my poises across. You'll notice the beam doesn't drop. So therefore I need additional weight. So the way you do that is you'd want to put on one attachment weight, which is a thousand grams, and see if the beam goes down. And yes it does. So now I'd use the 500 gram instead. Put the 500 gram beam, on, uh, 500 gram weight attachment weight on the beam, and again you'd want to slide your largest points across and see where the beam lifts up. So, no, well, it's still it's still down. So we'd have to go back to the 200. Ninety. Then again, you slide your riders across until you can get that hashtag at the very end of the beam lined up. And that looks pretty close right there. So, the way you determine the weight here is you need to add up all the weights again and so you'd have 500 for an attachment weight plus 200 is 7 plus 90 so we have 790 and it looks like 9 grams so I'll just zoom in a little so you can see that and so you would add the attachment weight plus the center rider, the rear rider, and the front rider. So you have 500 plus 200 is 700 plus 90 is 790 plus 9 grams. So this container would weigh 799 um, grams. Okay, I want to just go over some more features of the three beam balance. So, when you get the balance, there's going to be a washer on the rear of the three beam balance that you have to remove. This is to protect the scale in transit. So there's a large rubber washer or grommet, and this just pulls right out. So when you receive your three beam balance, you need to remove this. If you look at the very end, there's a curl knob here. This curl knob is to adjust the balance so you can raise the beam up and down by turning it clockwise or counterclockwise. So this is the curl knob on the rear of the three beam balance. Um, the balance pivots, we have agate bearings here. There are two on this side, two on the other side, and so the beam just pivots up and down. 
And this is why it's called, again, a three beam balance. You have three beams and it's balancing, it's pivoting on these agate bearing points. Um, the balance features a six inch, this is a large six inch stainless steel pin. The pin is stationary and it cannot be removed. Um, we went over the beams themselves. We described how there's grooves in here to lock it into place. We explained about the hash tag on the very end here, how you adjust the hash tag so it lines up. There's a vein right here um, on the pointer and the way this three beam balance works is there's two magnets on each side so it slows down the oscillation to give you a faster reading altogether. Um, the MyWay three beam balance comes with MyWay's uh, 30, 30 year unlimited manufacturer, 30 year limited manufacturer warranty. This warranty is through the MyWay scale company. Um, the balance has been extremely popular and if you have any other questions you can give us a call. We are Precision Way and Balances and we're an authorized MyWay distributor and these balances are always in stock.